Hey Leo, hey Dick, Lance here from Las Vegas. Uh, don't know why I rose my hand like I was going to be talking in class, but I did it just for you. Nonetheless, I have this little device here. Um, obviously I invented it. Probably back in the 70s, I mean, because, <laughs> you know, radio was great, right? Except for Saturdays. Radio is awesome. And Sundays. Uh, but anyway, except the Gizwiz isn't on Sundays. It's okay. I like Tuesday. But, but anyways, what do we have here? Just looks like a Walkman, right? Old fashioned, and you got your old fashioned tape, right? Well, this isn't actually. This is basically, yeah, a Walkman. You could play regular cassettes, right? But, maybe Dick already knows. Leo, good chance you do too. Well, you have two inputs for uh, headphones. But anyways, uh, you have your power on, off, and you have your regular buttons, radio, tape. Uh, but how does this have a radio? I mean, this is old. I mean, really old. Uh, but it's made by Toshiba. It's metal, and they really want you to know. Um, and here you have your DC 6-volt uh, input, or you can have batteries, and it requires a lot of batteries. But nonetheless, you take this sucker, and what is this exactly? This is actually an FM tuner. That's right, it has the little contacts in the back here, which you gotta keep clean, otherwise it's not gonna work properly. But nonetheless, uh, here is the dial to go up and down to tune the radio, which I'll show you in a moment. And then you have stereo or mono, so really it's not too old, but uh, nonetheless, plus it's handheld. Uh, but it is amazing, it is literally an FM tuner that you put in this well, at the time, it was considered really portable, obviously. Uh, but So let's go ahead and put this in here. And there's a little lock, you know, because maybe you know. Tell me. Uh, anyways, so you close it, and there's a little hole right here to switch up and down to choose uh, what radio station. Um, this isn't the best room for testing. I don't have a lot of audio equipment in here. And um, Let's go upstairs to the 5.1. Now we'll go over here. Here's what we need. Our receiver, as you see, just a normal receiver. And so now we have the side of the device. As you see, we have the play button, the stop button, the volume control, which is old school. Now we just do a digital or side button, which we press up and down. This is, you know, really old. And again, here's a better view of uh, the dial here, you know. Uh, but anyways, yeah, so let's go see this in action. And so you see we simply have it hooked up to RCA and plug it in the phono as seen. And uh, we'll go ahead and uh, turn on and uh, press play. Make sure the audio is very low because this can get very loud. So we'll go ahead and slowly turn up the volume. As you see here, it's static. Ouch. And that's it for the Toshiba Stereo Cassette Player, uh, model KT81.